And speaking of Thanksgiving, pretty soon you'll all be getting together with your friends or your family for the holiday, even as COVID cases continue to spread tonight. So we want to know, are you taking any precautions ahead of the holiday? Go ahead and open the camera on your phone and scan that QR code you see to vote tonight. Here are your options. You're getting a COVID test to take a precaution. You're getting a booster shot. Maybe you're wearing a mask or maybe you're not taking any precautions at all. What we're going to do is keep this QR code up for the next few minutes or so, so you have some time time to vote. In the meantime, though, we're going to send it out to News 12 New Jersey's Marcy Rubin, who is live in Hoboken tonight to explain how some people are making sure they're extra protected. Marcy. Absolutely, Brittany. Earlier tonight, there was a long line outside of what was a booster and children's or pediatric vaccine clinic here. And right around the corner, just a few doors down, a testing site where appointments were back to back, showing, proving that people really are taking COVID uh, protections and precautions seriously going into the Thanksgiving holiday weekend. You gotta lift your head up and we gotta do both nostrils, okay? That's fine. Candace Thompson was nonstop for four hours straight Tuesday night. Conducting COVID tests in Hoboken. You all good to go. Enjoy your Thanksgiving. Thank you, you too. Have Thank a good one. You. The medical assistant kept a smile on her face and the line moving. Her back to back appointments proof how popular the tests are once again as we go into Thanksgiving weekend. They were booked solid at this location hosted by Hoboken and Medicine Man Pharmacy with 180 swabs taken today alone. They want to make sure that, you know, they get tested first and then they see it, even though they are vaccinated. Uh, they just want to take a precaution, and that's why uh, we're getting a lot of demand for testing from last two to three days. Just want to make sure I'm healthy for the holidays. Uh, I was in London for business last week, and I'm meeting family in Long Island uh, on Thursday, so I thought it would be the respectful thing to do. And it's just as busy next door at a COVID booster and pediatric vaccine clinic. 600 people boosted here between Monday and Tuesday at times. People waiting on lines we haven't seen in months. Many saying they'd have taken the booster anytime it became available Thanksgiving or not, but we're thankful to bring home that extra protection for the holiday. It certainly helps, especially with younger ones and older ones, right? So if I'm a little bit better protected, it's better for everybody. So Marcy, Thanksgiving is less than 48 hours away at this point. Um, if people are getting the booster shot, does it kick in right away? It starts to have some effectiveness right away, but really the um, antibodies, doctors say, start to increase a few days after your booster shot with full protection, full effectiveness coming about two weeks after the shot. But they also say that if you are already fully vaccinated, meaning the two uh, vaccines uh, two weeks after that, you are very well protected and much more protected than people who may not have gotten vaccinated at all. In Hoboken, Marcy Rubin, News 12, New Jersey.